Authorities handling the Sagbama Ekeremal Road in Bayelsa have been told to speed up work to ensure it gets to stone base level for holidaymakers to travel this Yuletide. The State Works and Infrastructure Commissioner Lawrence Ewojakbo spoke to TVC's Ovietime Church. The Bayelsa Ecumenical Center at Igbogini was the first port of call for the inspection team of the State Ministry of Works and Infrastructure. Commissioner Lawrence Erujakbo and his men had earlier stopped over to inspect work at the Onopa Tourist Island Bridge before hitting the dusty path of the Sabama Ekeremo Road all the way to Alebiri. We actually drove to Alebiri today. Yeah, you saw that we're actually at Alebiri today. But we still have about uh, seven kilometers more to go on the stone base. So we have a lot of challenge in terms of uh, supply of uh, materials. So what we have decided to do is that we are spoken with the contractor, so we want to move in some more tippers, uh, trailers to move in to help bring in more materials. So we are working with the contractors. We believe that uh, we will still be able to pull through that uh, by uh, 24th or 25th of uh, December, small vehicles should be able to drive to our library. We've gone there actually with uh, our helocks, but that's not what the governor wants. What the governor wants is for small cars, even keke, to be able to drive to our library. And we hope we are going to still be able to achieve that. The level of work at the University of Africa is encouraging, the commissioner says, that the pace of work on the Senate building road is slow. We have to think of relocating so that uh, we pile more pressure on the contractors at site so that we can get what we want to get. Uh, also at the hostel, the contractors also need to develop their efforts. So, uh, like I just uh, give instruction to the head of the department, civil engineering now, I just asked him to start work on the internal roads, uh, both in the main campus and uh, here at the Hostels. We have got a generator that will move to the hostel, a 1,000 kV, kV generator that will move to the hostel to supply the hostels and then supply some essential parts of the main campus so that uh, uh, during off hours when the main campus generator will be off, the students here will always continue to have light. Lawrence Serujakbo has threatened to sanction any airing contractor who falls behind the expected completion date of any project. Ovietime George. TVC News, Tororua, by Yolso